Hi, everyone, and good morning. We've been lucky out with great viewing for the eclipse. We had some clouds here and there earlier, but now it looks like they've become scattered and patchy, so I think most of you are going to be able to see it. Let's take a look at the News 8 Storm Team forecast for today, though. Mostly sunny skies after morning clouds clear out. Breezy and pleasant with high temperatures close to 70. For tonight, we'll see mostly clear skies, cooler lows in the 40s. It's in the upper 50s out there right now, so tomorrow morning will feel quite a bit cooler. For tomorrow afternoon, mostly sunny, followed by increasing high clouds late in the day. Seasonal high temperatures again, picture perfect for October with highs in the mid-60s. Right now, live in Harrisburg, we have 57 degrees. There are some patchy clouds around. Winds are out of the southwest at 8 miles per hour, helping to keep the atmosphere mixed up and keeping that warm air close to the surface. Look at the numbers here. 57 in Lancaster, same for Carlisle. Chambersburg, we're at 55 in Sealands Grove and Gettysburg, and 59 warm spot there in Reading. Wind speeds currently out of the west or southwest. A disturbance moved through late last night. The wind picked up behind that, and I think today winds are going to stay sustained at 10 to 15 miles per hour, maybe even up to 20. Live on Super Doppler 8, no rain to show you. That's all off to our north and east. The clouds that were lingering overhead in many spots are now moving east as well. So if you still have some patchy clouds, they'll be lifting out shortly. Bigger picture here shows high pressure building in from the Great Lakes from the Midwest, and that's going to sit over us tonight and for most of tomorrow, too, keeping the sky sunny. Predictor shows us that trend for today, mostly sunny. High pressure rolls across Indiana and Ohio. We're looking great tonight. With high pressure in control, we'll see clear skies, lighter winds, and lows in the 40s. Now, tomorrow starts out sunny, but you see these high clouds coming in from the west? They'll be thickening in our sky, especially by evening. I think we'll even work in some showers overnight Thursday into Friday. Friday, there will be periods of rain. Very light in nature, but still kind of a damp and dreary day here to end the work week for us. Let's check out the event forecast for today. The Mannheim Community Farm Show continues with the parade this evening. Couldn't ask for better weather. Temperatures will be in the 60s today, and temperatures will not stay in the 60s for the rest of the week as well. Here's the extended forecast. You can see by the weekend, we have a chance for some morning rain on Saturday, but it clears out in the afternoon. Sunday, clouds roll right back in, but we're looking for a mainly dry day then. For Monday and Tuesday, chances for showers here and there. We still need some rain, guys. We're still trying to make up that deficit from September, so... I guess we'll take it when we can get it, right? That's right. It's been a very dry September and a dry start to October so far. We're only yeah. about four minutes away now from the yes. total eclipse. Exciting. Yeah. It, it is. No, it really is neat to watch. Am I the only person that keeps thinking of the 80s song Total Eclipse of the Heart? I know. Now you got me singing. Bonnie it. Tyler is <laughs> in know. my head. I all know. We need to show that, yeah, with, <laughs> with, with the picture. Whatever That's happened right. to Bonnie Tyler? Yeah. I loved her voice. Good question.